Say, what is that over there by the sundial in Carefree? Oh, that's the Venues Cafe. And this is Catherine Maher, and that's Eugene, the chef, uh, Eugene Knox. This is kind of the Venues team, right? It is, yes. it or is. Part of the team. Welcome to the Morning Scramble, Thank both you, of Pat. you. Thank you, And Pat. remind everybody right now who just got here what I was talking about concerning the sundial. Well, we are in the center of Carefree, um, right in the town center, right down from the sundial. We have bright red awnings, you can't miss us. And uh, beautiful Carefree Gardens are right across the street from us. And just in case you just got here and you have no idea what any of us are talking about concerning the sundial, that's kind of the symbol of Carefree. And everybody that goes there knows where the sundial is. So why don't you go there if you haven't been, check out the sundial, and check out Venues Cafe. Eugene, what are you making for us? I'm gonna make a chicken salad sandwich, Catherine chicken salad sandwich. Not just any. It's not any, it's <laughs> Catherine chicken it's salad. It's Catherine's. Yes. Okay, so what's different about this chicken salad? Well, we have dried cranberries in it, uh, almonds, uh, celery salt in there, salt, celery. If, uh, we grill the chicken really, really nice. We dice it up and with mayonnaise on there and put it all together and it tastes, tastes great. Well, this is <laughs> look at, you know what? It sounds great already, but you better start making it so we don't run out of time. Yes, sir. Because it is, after all, Catherine's chicken, chicken salad. salad, and Catherine is standing right here. We got next butter to lettuce. Watching the entire process. The unique thing, Pat, is my children ate it growing up. So butter I lettuce. figured if my kids would eat it, then it was a winner. All parents and grandparents <laughs> know exactly what you mean. Now listen. Let's talk, though, about why it is that these days people are particularly happy going to the venue cafe. Happy hour. Well, thank you for bringing that up, Pat. We have happy hour during the summer all night long. So you get discounted uh, cocktails, we'll make wine, green. draft beer, and we do all local drafts. And... Um, you can be happy all night long at venues. And let's talk about some of the things that are offered uh, during the happy we got hour the, period, which is all night long. We have uh, happy, happy hour drinks tomatoes. all night long. We have um, a variety of meals that we offer, and it's 20% off the food for the entire month of August until Labor Day. We have wait, everything wait, wait, from wait, a... Wait, 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 don't skip over that. 20% off the food. 20% for off. Allowed during happy hour, which lasts from when to when? Starts at three o'clock and lasts all night long. We're open until nine o'clock. If you think you can last all night long, the Venues Cafe <laughs> is the place to test it. And my understanding is, and I haven't been to Venues yet, but I will, Carefree is just this terrific community on the north end of the valley. It is. And one of the few places that I know in town serving schnitzel we do. We have chicken schnitzel, which is one of our specialties, with a lingonberry sauce, Ooh. which is my personal favorite. We have everything from a 16-ounce bone-in ribeye, a Gold Canyon, just superb, melts in your mouth, fresh halibut. We kind of run the gamut. We've presented some nice summer items today, but we well, have... Let's, let's be specific. What is this? Well, yeah. Eugene talked about the chicken salad. And in the middle here, we have a spinach strawberry summer salad, which has, as you can see, the strawberries, onions, um, bacon, bacon, eggs, eggs, onions. And Eugene, what's over here? It's a quinoa. We have a uh, fresh uh, grape, grapefruit, grapefruit, uh, grapefruit segments, segments, the chicken, the red cabbage, uh, cabancho beans. And quinoa is one of your seven superfoods, so it's really good for you. We make the dressing in-house, and Eugene just does a super job. Eugene, I don't know about you, but when I was growing up, I never heard of quinoa in my life. And the last few years, it has really taken over. Yes. I know that it's good for you. Is it fun to prepare foods with? Yes, it's very fun. It's, uh, you know, it's very fun to, to do the quinoa. It's a healthy lifestyle uh, grain. It's you know, known as a mother grain, and it's really healthy for you. Exactly. Okay, so when I come out to venues, by the way, we should also acknowledge that not only do you have healthy food, 
You have food that's really terrific tasting. You have a huge variety of things. And with football season just around the corner, you've also got a lot of television screens, right? We do, right? we do. Three, three flat screens around the bar. What's life like on Sunday at venues? Well, we go from a champagne brunch right into football. So it's, uh, it kind of runs the gamut again. It's always a different venue. You know what? I think I just heard the voices of somebody who just got here from Cedar Rapids, Iowa. Right, family? Okay, they just came in in an SUV. They parked, went in, turned on the television set, as, as they should for the morning scramble. Exactly. And they're saying, where is Carefree? They have no idea how to get there. So north of Scottsdale, uh, Scottsdale north to Tom Darlington, we're on 34 Easy Street in Carefree, Arizona. So I'm on Scottsdale Road, right? And I run right into Carefree? Exactly. And, and look for a friendly name like Tom Darlington and an even friendlier name like Venues Cafe. It's adjacent to the sundial.